Hey, what is up guys? This is Mo. Welcome back to the channel. Today, we're going to be talking about the Aeron Gaming Chair by Herman Miller. This is a super special chair and I'm going to be telling you everything you need to know about it. Now, before we get started, I wanted to say thank you to everybody who's been watching the videos and subscribed to the channel. If you're watching these videos, enjoying them, and you're not subscribed yet, then hit that subscribe button. It's super easy. It's free. It helps the growth of my channel and it gets my content to more viewers. Now, without further ado, let's get right into it. All right, so this is the Herman Miller Aeron gaming chair. The Aeron is an absolute icon. I mean, this chair is everywhere. TV shows, movies, artists, even with a former president. Once named the best-selling chair in America, if you were to walk into many offices of big companies, you'll probably see the Aeron all over the place. The Aeron even has a permanent display in the Museum of Modern Art. At almost $1,500, this chair is an investment in your sitting health and well-being, and it also has a great resale value even after years of usage. When the Aeron first came out, it was one of a kind. It threw away what people were used to seeing in an office chair. No more foam and leather, it gave people something completely new, focused on ergonomics and the user's well-being. Well, it's been a really long time since the first Aeron came out, and Herman Miller remastered the Aeron in 2016 to bring it up to date with all the research they have done and knowledge they have gained. So, what really sets the gaming edition apart from the standard Aeron? Only the color. It's the same as the remastered Aeron, but comes in a special edition black color to match gaming setups better. So whatever I say in this review also applies to a similarly configured standard Aeron remastered chair. All right, let's kick this off with talking about the design and the materials. The Aeron gaming chair retains the famous silhouette of the original Aeron chair. The look of the chair is very modern, inspiring, and it really is one of a kind. When I looked at this chair, I definitely feel its presence in my office. It just elevates the design of this room. The gaming Aeron comes in two sizes, a size B and a size C, as well as two different cylinder heights, a standard and a high. To identify which chair best fits your height and weight, Herman Miller provides a sizing chart on their website. The high cylinder starts an inch higher and ends at two inches higher than the standard cylinder for taller users. Now I'm 6'5 and 210 pounds. So my chair is the size C gaming Aeron with the high cylinder to ensure I get enough clearance from the ground for my legs to be at a 90 degree angle. The black color of the frame and upholstery is striking and will look fantastic in any setting, especially gaming setups. The thick and pronounced frame feels very solid and is made of a specialized injection molded nylon. The mechanism housing case is completely redesigned from the original Aeron. The wires have been cleaned up and it looks and functions a lot better. The upholstery used is Herman Miller's own 8Z pellicle. Both the back and the seat are covered in this material. The 8Z pellicle is unique to the Aeron and it is the highest quality mesh you'll ever come across. The mesh has been updated from the original Aeron as well. The pellicle now has eight latitudinal zones of varying tension. So it's a bit more forgiving in the middle and more tense around the edges to ensure a customized fit for different bodies. The arms are nicely contoured and made of a high density foam. They are also attached to the back rather than the seat. This ensures that your arms don't separate from your body as you tilt back. Finally, the casters are deep black and are designed for both carpet and hard floors. They have a quiet roll feature, which means they are silent when they roll around, and they also have a braking feature so the chair doesn't roll away when you're not sitting in it. The gaming Aeron also comes with an awesome 12 year warranty that covers for 24 seven usage. All right, let's go over the ergonomic features and adjustments. Starting off with the seat height adjustment. The seat height adjustment tab can be found on the right side of the chair. Pulling on this tab while not seated will bring the chair higher and pulling on it while seated will bring the chair lower. The Aeron is designed to have a natural S-shaped curve to the back. The gaming Aeron comes with the PostureFit SL back support system. The PostureFit SL is made up of two vertical pads covered in high density foam that help support the sacral and lumbar regions of your back to keep you from slouching. To adjust the PostureFit SL system, use the knob found on the system. Twisting the knob clockwise will make the pads more pronounced to increase the amount of support and match the curve of your back better. 
while twisting it counterclockwise decreases the tension of the pads for people who don't need too much support. The tilt limiter and lock knob can be found on the lower left side of the chair. It has three different levels. The first level locks the chair in the most upright position. The second level stops the tilt motion halfway through. And the third level allows for free recline. The tilt tension knob can be found on the right side of the chair. Twisting this clockwise will increase the tension, making it harder to recline in the chair, while twisting it counterclockwise makes reclining easier. A special adjustment the Aeron has is the forward tilt feature. This isn't commonly seen on many office chairs. This feature allows you to tilt 5 degrees forward towards your desk for more intensive tasks such as gaming and those really intense typing sessions. This can be engaged by reclining slightly back in the chair and twisting the knob clockwise. This is definitely one of my favorite features of this chair, but it allows me to sit in my favorite gaming forward position while still getting the back support I need. The arms are 3D arms. You can adjust the height of the arms by unlocking the tab in the back of each arm, putting it to your preferred height, and then locking the tab. The depth of the arms can be adjusted by sliding the arms back and forth. The angle and width of the arms can be adjusted by pushing the arm in or out. So now that we've covered the design and adjustments, let's talk about the pros, the cons, and my personal experience with it. Let's start off with what I like about this chair. This has been my dream chair for a long time. The design language really speaks to me and inspires me. For me, this is the best looking office chair, and it just got better because the gaming edition finally brings the black color I wanted to the table. The gaming Aeron is offered in two different sizes, and cylinder heights to ensure a wide range of body types is covered. The chair design will ensure you sit in a correct posture and help you avoid unhealthy sitting habits. I can sit in the chair for a full day and then also game for a few hours at night without feeling any back pain. This is a game changer for someone like me who has to sit for work, for gaming, and to work on my YouTube videos. I find both the seat and the back are very comfortable and the back comfort and support has especially impressed me. The build quality is a 10 out of 10. This is a really high quality solid chair. Every piece of it feels premium. It's the best I've come across in any chair. It's even better than the gaming and body that I reviewed on this channel recently. There's no creaking or noises in any part of the chair. The 8Z pellicle mesh is stretchy and comfortable because it's a mesh, I never run warm in the chair, and I don't see myself going back to foam because of how nice that feels. I don't have an original Aeron to compare right now, but the 8 zones of varying tension is noticeable. The chair is supportive but comfortable in the middle where my weight is more focused, and tenser on the frame where my body isn't too heavy. The Aeron is famous for its recline, and I can really see why it's acclaimed for it. The tilt mechanism on the Aeron is so smooth and natural. Reclining is very easy and the chair feels like a rocking chair. Using the tilt tension, you can fine tune the recline to best match your weight. Once you've achieved that, it makes the Aeron truly one of a kind. The Aeron goes one step further and attaches the arms to the back instead of the seat. This means your arms stay in the same position throughout the whole recline motion. I really find myself using the recline feature a lot in this chair when I've never really used it on any normal office chair I've had before. The arms are hands down the most comfortable arms I've used. They completely beat the gaming and body arms and they also top out the secret lab titan arms. They are soft, squishy, supportive and have a pure luxury feel. The casters roll very smoothly and are very quiet. They don't rattle like the embody casters or the secret lab titan casters. It also comes fully assembled with a 12 year warranty. Now let's talk about the cons. The pronounced frame can potentially be a problem for some users. If the frame comes in contact with your body, you may feel uncomfortable. To avoid this, you need to make sure you choose the correct size for your body using the chart Herman Miller provides. Also, in terms of size, this isn't the best chair if multiple people are using it because of the size difference. One chair will not fit all. 
The frame and chair design also do not allow for different seating postures. You can only sit up straight in the air on. You won't be able to cross your legs or put your legs up. So if you like to cross your legs, the air on is not for you. The arm height adjustment is different from most chairs that have a simple button. Unlocking the tab, adjusting, and locking the tab again takes a longer time. Some people may just be annoyed by this, but I don't adjust the arms too much after I found my preferred height. Because if I want to get closer to the desk, I can just use the depth adjustment. Finally, the most polarizing point about this chair is the pellicle upholstery. People either love it or hate it. There's really no in between here. Although pellicle is much better than any other regular mesh, if you are irritated by mesh, you may still feel the same way about the Aeron. So overall, I'd consider the Aeron the best office chair for those who want a high performance, customizable chair for themselves, and it's my choice for my own office. The gaming edition made it even better by adding the black color and ideal configuration of features for gamers. At 6'5", I'm a tall guy, and this chair serves my height and size well. It also saves my back from the pain that I experience with my gaming chairs like the Secret Lab Titan, while keeping me cool and comfortable. It also comes with a 12 year warranty for peace of mind and to make my investment last as long as possible. Thank you guys so much for watching my review of the Aeron Gaming Chair by Herman Miller. If you enjoyed this review, then smash that like button. And if you want to find your way back to more of my content, then subscribe with notifications on. Guys, it's super easy to subscribe and it's completely free and it really helps the growth of my channel. So just do it. Have an awesome day, everybody, and I'll see you guys next time.